Are you tired of living paycheck to paycheck or just getting by? Well, in this video, I'm gonna go ahead and cover three things that rich people do that poor people don't. Listen, if you're tired of struggling and you're tired of living paycheck to paycheck and you wanna live life on your own terms, right? You have to have wealth, right? You have to build wealth so that way you have more choices. That's all wealth is, right? The more money you make, some people say it's the root of all evil. But at the end of the day, all it does is it's a tool and it's resources that you can use to actually build your dream life. Hey, how's it going? My name is Eric Ellis. And basically in this video, we're gonna be covering the three things that rich people do that poor people don't and how you can start implementing these three things into your lifestyle so that way you can stop living a life of poverty and start living a life of abundance. Now the first thing that rich people do that poor people don't is they buy assets, not liabilities. Whenever they're making a purchasing decision, they're thinking, what is my return on my investment? Meaning, when you shop, most, most people shop, 99% of the people who shop or buy things, they buy as a consumer, right? They're thinking, okay, I'm buying this because this makes me feel good. I'm buying this, this, this watch because it makes me feel good. I'm buying this brand because it makes me feel good. Instead of investing $300 into a Gucci belt, right, you can literally, in Florida, I live in Florida, this is Miami, Florida right now, you can go to sunbiz.com and for less than $300, for less than a Gucci belt, you can invest into starting a corporation so that way you can pay less in taxes, right? That's an example, right? Look for investment opportunities. Look for things that you can actually purchase that will help you grow. Stop being a slave to money and make money your slave. Number two is when it comes to rich people, one thing that they do that uh, poor people don't do is they focus, right? They have a laser freaking focus. If you notice, poor people, again, they, there's a lot of consumption. They like to consume social media. They like to consume uh, basically TV, the, the, the idiot box, right? There's so many things that people do that are wasting their freaking time. They're not focusing. They're easily distracted. A rich person is focused on one thing and one thing only. They know how to delegate other things and focus on the income producing activities. Meaning, stop having the shiny object syndrome. Stop jumping from thing to thing to thing to thing. Figure out exactly what you wanna do, what results you're trying to accomplish, and focus on that one thing until you bring it into fruition. And last but not least, number three, is what rich people do that poor people don't. They have persistence. You will not see a self-made multimillionaire or billionaire who does not have persistence. Why? Because listen, you fell your way to success. The only difference between rich people and poor people, and I'm talking about self-made, I'm not talking about daddy money, is that they failed more than you. They were willing to fail more times than you, right? When things got hard, they did not give up. They persisted. They were willing to fail. They were willing to get punched in the mouth. They were willing to freaking go through the triumphs and the tribulations and failed companies. The average millionaire has been bankrupt once. I've been bankrupt three different times, right? I've been bankrupt three different times. I've failed on over 10 different businesses, right? And the thing that sets me apart from me and you, the thing that allows me to have this, this penthouse view is because I decided when things got hard, instead of folding and taking the easy way out, like going to a nine to five or maybe saying this entrepreneurship thing isn't for me, is I stuck it through, I got results, I analyzed my situation and saw, okay, what can I do different I looked at failures as lessons instead of as defeat. So with that being said, if you guys want to be successful, if you guys want to be rich, if you guys want to stop living a life of poverty and live a life of abundance, you need to start buying things, right? Assets instead of liabilities, things that are gonna to go to make you money. Don't be a slave to money, make money your slave. You need to start focusing, stop having the shiny object syndrome. You need to persist when things get hard, push through. And anything, anything you could ever imagine your life being will come true.